Well, 32.4 is his score. 32.1 is this lady's score. We're into the top 10 now. Roz Canters and Shearer yeah. had a brilliant result here 12 months ago and looking for more of the same in 2018. Can she get some big series points on the board early? She thinks the absolute world of this horse, he really is a family pet, has been with her for a number of years and she knows him inside out. So now we're going to see this whole body language change. You know, you can see that but, um, Roz, the same as Blythe, you know, she's she's just a little bit more in a jockey position between the fences. She's encouraging the horse to keep traveling at the fences. She's trying to pick up those first distances where they're available. She wants to get through those combinations as quickly and efficiently as possible. Through the Chick Retreats Ice Pond up at 13 A and B. So Roz is another very efficient cross-country rider. She's All of the messages she's giving to the horse are very sort of positive and they're soft and they're sympathetic so she's not wasting the horse's energy and she's not being too defensive she's able to to balance the horse before a fence just using her upper body and and using a much more subtle aid so right now this is where you're having to see her to work the hardest because she's going down a very steep slope and even though you can see Roz having to put all of her sort of six stone that she weighs into uh, trying to balance the horse and, and keep him a little bit on his bum. She was working hard, but she did nicely. Roz Kanter is 24 seconds down on the clock. She's 26 seconds in hand to go ahead of uh, Astier Nicola and alert to Amelie Bork. Can she do it, Sam? Oh, she was really nice on that turn. She was super through there. She. She's going to set her a really good score here. Well, the penalties that will be clicking up now, 0.4, remember, for every second over the time. Astier Nicola on 42.7. Roz Cantor coming to the final fence. She clears it very well, and she is going to go to the top of the podium. She's our new leader, second fastest round of the day so far. 14 seconds over, Roz Cantor and Zen Shearer. It's hugely deserved. Well, uh, Ros Cantor taking over at the top of the podium for a few moments. Astier Nicola, well, I think he's got a ferry to catch, so he's going to be dashing off pretty shortly as well. I don't know how long he'll be staying on the podium anyway, because these top few are coming quick and fast now. Wills Oakden and Cooley Romero out on course in seventh place. Well, Ros Cantor is at the top of the podium. She's only going to be there for a few minutes, but I'm sure she'll enjoy it, Hannah. She looks like she's already enjoying it, Nicole. Ros, how was it? Oh, it was super out there today. Um, Zen Shearer is um, a real favourite of mine, and we know each other inside out, so um, it's just great fun to ride a horse like him. Ros, you have had some superb results towards the end of last year, coming into this year. I really feel like you've come out guns blazing. Does it feel like it's all coming together? Um, yes, definitely. It, you know, it takes a long time to get up to this level, but the horses that I've got at this level now are, you know, have been up here for a while, so um, I just hope I can keep finding some nice ones to come through and replace them one day. And you love them all so much. Yeah, I do. Um, this one particularly, he's very special. He's a bit like a family pet. So, um, but I do. I love my horses, and I'm very proud of what they do for me. And are we going to see you on some of the other ERM events throughout the year? I hope so, yeah. I, I probably haven't got quite enough at this level to really target it, but it's such good fun, and um, this horse particularly loves stuff like this. So, yeah, we'll definitely try and do some more. Well, we love having you both here. Thanks, Roz. Thank you.